This looks pretty familiar, right, over the past several days. Uh, we're looking at pretty low visibility. This is, of course, high up, as you know, several hundred feet uh, in the air. At a ground level, not as bad, but we are at three mile visibility actually improved over the past hour or so. And wind, it's elevated just enough to, again, keep things uh, pretty agreeable as far as visibility is concerned. Not perfect, but better. 1.6 in Fort Wayne, 4.5 in Decatur, 6 mile visibility in Angola, 4 in Defiance. So just about everywhere across northern Indiana, northwest Ohio. Seeing visibility that isn't perfect, uh, but it's at least better than it was a couple days ago. Satellite and radar also showing a pretty misty trend here tonight. That's going to essentially be the trend overnight into early tomorrow morning before we just turn the attention to just cloudy skies. By between 1 and 3 a.m., cloudy conditions with some mist and then some fog clouds from 5 to 7 a.m. should actually see that fog lift by 9 with cloudy skies, temperatures into the upper 30s. Future track showing cloudy skies by about 1, 2 p.m. Not much variance or change in the overall weather pattern. Late Saturday into Sunday, though, we see a storm system wind up and move north and east out of our area. It's likely going to clip portions of Allen County, but south and east of about Decatur, Van Wert, Portland, there could be temperatures in the mid 30s that'd be cold enough for a rain snow mix. So fortunately, no freezing rain, more like a slushy, very wet snow that's unlikely to accumulate beyond maybe a little bit of accumulation on grassy surfaces. That's out of here pretty quickly by Sunday morning, so kind of a non-event for most. As we head into Sunday afternoon, mostly cloudy conditions and looking pretty dry for the rest of next week. So as I mentioned, that draining, as slow as it is, uh, should at least be aided by you know, no additional rainfall over the next seven days, uh, which you know, should keep things closer to normal by the end of next week. Temperatures right around 40 degrees tomorrow afternoon by Sunday afternoon, upper 30s to right around 40 degrees. And then into Monday afternoon, temperatures likely be in the mid to upper 30s. So a cooler day Monday, probably the coldest day over the next seven. But, you know, again, we're, st we're still looking at uh, temperatures well above average. We should be at about 32 or so for average high temperatures. And we're not really going to see freezing high temperatures for probably the next couple weeks. A future wind gusts show northerly wind between about 25, 30 miles per hour possible. This is tomorrow morning between about 9, 10 a.m. Heading into Sunday afternoon, could see wind gusts between 25 and 30 miles per hour. So turning pretty gusty at times into the afternoon. And then as we work our way through Sunday night, early Monday, those wind gusts will calm down a little bit. But yeah, much of the day on Sunday is expected to be pretty windy. Here's a look at the seven day forecast. I was able to change that background from a totally cloudy picture to at least some sun breaks because that's what we're expecting through a good part of next week. A cloudy weekend, kind of breezy on Sunday, 38 on Monday with clouds. But then the clouds begin to break up a little bit. It's beginning Tuesday, 40, with overnight lows returning to the freezing mark. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, though, partly sunny. A steady warming trend should get to about 50 degrees by Friday. I hope we can do a little better than that, but for now, keeping it a little more conservative. I think uh, getting to 50 is certainly possible, but when you uh, keep in mind that our average high temperature is 32, I was gonna say. anything over 32 is kind of a great deal. Yeah, it's <laughs> been amazing, the warmth, especially looking ahead like that yeah. in your seven day forecast. Yeah. And that sunshine, boy, I can't tell you how welcome that is. You know, since we've had this new on. graphic change, this is the first time we've been able to use partly sunny oh. on the seven day forecast. Nice. So <laughs> it's a nice change. Yeah, dear diary yeah. for sure. <laughs> Thank All right, you, Matt. Matt. Thanks. Coming up on 21.